dog is, I mean, if I'm paying for it, the dog is mine. I'm not going to do that. I'll just tell you right now, point blank, I am not going to pay for the puppy. So y'all just on, went on one date and she already asked you to buy her a dog? <laughs> hey, put your shoes on, tie them mugs up real tight, bro, with the bow and a double, double knot. You know what I'm saying? Boy Scout knot, right? And beat feet that way. All right, so look, the first time I did one of these reactions, bro, I'm talking about this was hilarious, bro. Like, I couldn't believe these wives was having meltdowns after they got caught cheating. So it's only right that we hop straight back into it. If you're new to the channel, make sure you sub to the channel. Make sure you like this video. I'm going to be doing a lot more reactions and content like this. Let's get into it. My new sugar daddy. Say hi. Hello. When do you get paid? Can you take a picture of me real quick? Real quick. You just have to hold it. Actually, just hold it because I already pressed the button. Don't press nothing. Do, do I, am I in it? Yep. I am? Mm-hmm. <laughs> Don't hold them down. No? <laughs> <laughs> Asking creepy old men for help in Walmart. How are they creepy old men? But you recording them and, and doing doing stuff like that. But but they the creeps. Bruh. No cap. Body count. I'm only it's only forty three. That's eight percent of women initiate divorce. This is just an opinion as to why I think it's happening. What men want has not changed. Men want a nurturing partner to produce offspring and a peaceful home. I could be wrong. I don't know. I'm not a man. On the flip side, what women want and what is expected of them has changed. I fell into this trap that I can do anything that my husband can do but better. I can have a career like a man but act like a woman and then take care of everything in the house. Because according to Instagram, it's possible. According to feminism, if I'm not doing it, then I'm cutting myself short. And according right. to other women, if I don't have a job, I don't have value. According to magazines, if I don't look good while doing it, then I'm a lazy slob. When I was trying to do all the things, I kept thinking to myself, man, I need a wife. So I ended my toxic relationship. This is a great reason why you shouldn't let someone else dictate your value or your future or what you want to do. So okay, bro. I, she kept quoting like so many people, so many people have their opinions on life and how you should do it. You shouldn't care about someone else's opinion on your life. You should live your life for yourself to make yourself happy. That's all, all right, bro. Do. All right. Oh, yeah. Stop fucking playing. Stop 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 playing. Checks absolutely nothing on his phone. Looks over at me being busy sorting my wrist straps. These f straps taking up too much time. Makes a swift return. Sad lift. Uh, if you see her putting the straps on, I thought, because I was about to make up an excuse for bro. I'm thinking maybe he just putting, like, just curious on her putting the straps on her hands and that's why he was looking the first time but to double back and ask her if she using a bench when she clearly about to use that bar my boy now now, now you being creepy but i don't know seemed very enthusiastic about helping me get this dog figures you could afford it so i i really didn't realize that you were so cheap well, that's a lot of assumptions to make right off the bat about someone, especially on the first date. I never in my wildest dreams did I think I'd be going to a first date and then making a life decision, you know? A life decision? <laughs> 75 for, bucks. Uh, 75 bucks. Dog is, I mean, if I'm paying for it, the dog is mine. I'm not just going to do that. I'll just tell you right now, point blank, I am not going to pay for the puppy. So y'all is on... Uh... 
went on one date and she already asked you to buy her a dog? <laughs> hey, put your shoes on. Tie them mugs up real tight, bro, with the bow and a double double knot. You know what I'm saying? Boy Scout knot, right? And beat feet that way. <laughs> Hurry up. Get out of here, bro. If she want a dog after the first date, trust me, she wants some way. She going to want way too much, bro. No, not, not, not going to happen. At least me. I ain't trick daddy. You better go, <laughs> you better go down to the MIA for that. Fine. 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 And I just want to say, too, if you can't pay $75 for a puppy, how on earth are you going to be actually paying for the dog for the rest of its life? Dogs are not that expensive. That's okay? not you true. You don't have to clothe them or anything. Their food's cheap. <laughs> No, you don't have walk. to close them, but you got to take them to the vets. You got to pay for any medical bills. You got like food can get expensive real fast. They don't have their shots. Like, do you have a dog? Do you even know? I grew up with dogs. I don't have one now because of how expensive they are. Whatever. I mean, you're acting like I have to set up a college fund or something for it. It's a dog. It's <laughs> okay, we're, 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 we're gonna jump in here because no, our whole goal is to one. Hooking up with someone and then they go, oh, my friend wants to play video games. And I'm like, okay, bye. I'll leave then. He hooked up with you and he wanted to play video games. Then he was like, yeah, my friends want to play video games. And I was like, well, I'm not going to be here for that. What game was it? If it was Call of Duty, I get it. it I would do the same thing. Why can't bro bro play the game? I mean, what did he can't play the video game? Hey, I, I, I seen a video the other day and a girl was talking about she don't want no dude to be playing video games. Video games is going to keep him in the house, keep him away from the shorties, save him money because he ain't out spending and driving and riding and buying. Not, like you know what I'm saying, he, he might he might spend a couple extra dollars on depending on what game he playing if he want to, you know, advance. Anyway, bro, there's nothing wrong with video games. Dude, like that's the equivalent to a girl scrolling on social media all damn day. That, that kick you get out of reading people's comments and problems on Facebook is the same kick boys get out of playing a game with their dogs. You feel me? Like, come on, man. Beat your feet, shorty. Have you <laughs> anyone <laughs> yeah. else while we've been on a break? Okay, well, you know about right after we broke up when I was with Taylor. Yes. Penny. Don't say Jeff. Jeff. Ugh. Connor. Ugh. Carlos. Ugh. <laughs> you have that, that person at Timber. How many people? How many people shorty name? Hey, yo, y'all was... Hey, yo, I would have been on another break. You go back to Jeff T Taylor and all the other motherfuckers you just date right there, bro. That's crazy. I mean, uh, I ain't saying don't do nothing, but holy. And, and and then why does she name all dudes, though? And you obviously in a relationship with a woman. You don't even like women that much. Yo. Remember? Jordan? Remember people I like kissed? I don't remember. Damn. Okay, she got to remember. She belongs to the streets. Yes, sir. I would do anything to get this back. Anything? Like, anything? Anything. Hmm? See how she's biting her lip, though? You need the bag. If you just get a job, Kayla. Get a job. I'll do anything to get this bag. Anything? <laughs> Moved over real close to her. Anything? All right, I know what you could do. Get a job. <laughs> Simping. Do you want to know how to make her chase you? It's not going to chase you if you're chasing her. Most men know that women crave attention and they want it from the guys that are not giving it to them. Focus on your money and your body. If you focus on your business, career, and the gym, not only are you not thinking about girls that time, but you're also putting in the reps to becoming a 1% man woman desire. That's, so that's women will start to chase you. Full process is. That, was, that was facts, fellas. Any fellas on here that would take that, if you don't take no advice or nothing from this video, Take that. I'm telling you, work on your business and your body, bro. Facts. A little bit, of little, that, that money in the muscles, bro. Shorty ain't going nowhere. You ain't, you ain't got to worry about nothing. I want to be able to have travel. Be open-minded because if you're a traditional man, I'm assuming you want to have a family, you want to have kids. Don't you want to be with a woman that is worldly, educated, well-traveled, can bring something to the table rather than somebody that has absolutely no idea about anything in life and really can't contribute anything outside of just being a woman? Uh, no. <laughs> no, we don't want that at all. Being well-traveled is a giant red flag. 
What is she talking about? Because typically you see pictures of her on a private jet, on a yacht, in multiple different fancy locations. She's in Mykonos here, she's in Paris, she's in Dubai, she's in New York. My immediate assumption is this woman is a Obviously, oh, yeah. women that are traveling everywhere are going and living a luxurious lifestyle. They, I'm they, assuming that I'm looking all over Europe. For cities. What would, why would I be turned on by you living a luxurious lifestyle, though? That before you start talking, Shorty, just start thinking. Why would a man want that? Well traveled. Who gives a fuck if you well traveled? <laughs> like, come on now. I'm starving all day. And y'all got this lazy sitting here drinking Chick fil A. Get up and cook something. What I'm are you doing? Nothing for you. Go you cook something. Me? See, this why I'm not marrying you. Because you're sitting down all day. Go cook something. Do something. Facts. This is exactly why I'm not marrying you. What? You got the lights off. Turn the lights on. How are you mad? Because I want to relax. Look at this. Why do I got to cook for you? Who do you think I am? My girl. I'm not marrying you. I hope you know that. Set up. Rizikis. Chapter he he, he might have went a little, little, little. That was probably overkill. I ain't going to lie. That that might I ain't even gonna say probably that was that was overkill, unless she never cooked. So what he did was he let a lot of stuff build up, and explode it. You know what I'm saying? But uh, definitely don't marry her, brother. She said, "What I look like cooking for you? <laughs> I ain't get my girl." All right, so look, when I first clicked on that video, it said wife has a meltdown after she got caught cheating. Not one of these joints was cheating. That was that was definitely clickbait, bro. Alpha talk. That was definitely that was definitely clickbait. Switch the title up. So when people click on your videos, they getting what they signed up for. You feel me? Fuck you doing, bro? <laughs> no, nah, but all jokes aside, that was definitely a di uh, different type of video. Um, either way it go, you know what I'm saying? There was some 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 good uh, red flags in there for us to stick away and to, to catch during the beginning parts of these relationships, bro. So uh, yeah, I mean, at the end of the day, that just was another example of uh, people is delusional. I ain't just gonna say women. The niggas is delusional, too, for even be putting themselves in them situations. Uh, Shorty just laying on the couch all day. He said, ain't cooking. Got Chick-fil-A. You ain't make me. You ain't get me none. Obviously, I'm still hungry. I'm asking you to cook, man. Dude, you got to do something with yourself, man. You probably don't work or nothing. Dude, probably in there paying all the bills. You might be at your raises, Craig. I don't know what's going on, man. We're all crazy right now, but we're going to get into another video, hopefully. The next one that I find with it might, you know what I'm saying, somebody say say they cheating. Hopefully it's that. But no, um, we're about to get out of here. Make sure y'all sub to the channel. Make sure you like this video. Go MTV.